<laughs> my dude. What's up, guys? Got a new addition. Check it out. Apparently, I can't. I don't know how cameras work. <laughs> you can actually just point to it and it'll go to it. Okay, but it's behind me. I'm going to duck real quick. Boom! If you couldn't see it real quick, that's Gideon. That's like fucking everybody. Everybody's up there. Chandra, Liliana, and her sexy ass. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I agreed. It was a subscriber um, comment, but he's like, hey, dude, there's like way too much taupe going on. And, like, I agreed, dude. It's like just straight Caucasian. It's like Caucasian just all down here in the bottom right. So I got to break it up with some color. I don't know if that's going to stay. I actually uh, ordered that and had it like in a closet, but I never put it up on my wall. This is a man cave up here. You guys can't haven't seen it yet. That might might uh, be another reveal or something if you're interested, but it's at a very awkward height because of where I put the camera. Anyway, you guys literally don't give a fuck, but it does look a little bit better. Speaking of, uh, nothing I was talking about. We're playing <laughs> Indie Rage. Oh, man, this seems appropriate. I have a lot of fun with this deck. Uh, you know, I haven't really got back on like the deck building the whole thing but indie rage is in its final form i think this is ready for a deck tech i did have two naturalizes i did take them out like in between the last time you've seen this deck i took it out and i put elvish visionary back in just because i was having trouble drawing win conditions but that's pretty much like how this deck runs like you just like looking for your win con if you don't get it okay you didn't get it but i i put it in i was like oh this would be way better but then i the second game i took naturalize out i played against raid bombardment and snap loss and i was like i'm an idiot putting naturalize back in but this is the deck as it sits the mana base has not changed i don't think this deck has changed at all i'm sorry if it has but this deck will be running let's get to it guys and then th that's something else i have to think about like i can't just like fuck off because you're fucking looking at me like <laughs> usually i'm just like oh i just chug my beer oh. nailed that intro i just chug my beer and then get into the game but can't do that anymore let's get to it what's up blondie i'll play with you brother Thanks for hanging out with me. I don't know why I'm playing this deck. I, don't know why I was thinking, like, in in just sitting there, thinking about life choices I've made in the past, present, and future. Can't keep this. Hands horrible. Why am I playing this deck? This deck is not easy to pilot, okay? Like, just right out the gate, you're just going to, like, plop down this son of a bitch. I mean, it's good. I win with it, but I w honestly, I want to play against a goblin deck. Those are the best. Uh-oh. It still could be. Is it goblins? And that... Oh, wow. That actually could be the worst deck I could play against. You know what? We're going to have times and situations where we're going to have tap lands and be cool with it. Uh, several turns, probably. So we're going to get the untapped source down for Wall of Omens. I mean, is it Goblins might literally be the worst deck to play against. Because it's, it's aggro and they can counter like all the bullshit. Like, oh, cute safe passage. Negate. Um, okay, you got a fog also, and even if it, even if the negate, even if I, the fog resolves, it's horrible for me. Like any sort of counter magic in in conjunction with a board state is horrible for me. But I mean, he can just like negate into dissolve for my um, backup, either another safe passage, or uh, I just almost I just almost nutted because I saw Torin that I drew, or um, Whatever. Uh, fog. There, there we go. Okay, so get in the paint, brother. Get in the paint. You're playing a game. Blondie, Spell Slinger, she's definitely slinging goblins. I mean, Blondie is a girl, okay? For all intents and purposes, she is a girl in my opinion. And I'm going to say she's smoking. I'm going to do Selesnya. Tap land, sure. So this is blue-red control, obviously. I'm not going to say obviously. It might be a very poorly mulliganed aggro deck. We will probably see here. Well, we're wrong on all fronts. Holy shit, this is a fucking foot race. Get ready. Get your running shoes ready. Um, because he's trying to mill me, and I can't do anything about it. I can planar cleanse, though, right? Actually, he's... he's oh, man. These are such dead draws right now against this deck, because he's not going to be doing damage against me unless he runs Vent Sentinel also. And then the safe passages are amazing, and the fogs are cabbage. The, the fogs are straight horrible. The only thing they have better than safe passages is they count as one. But... This is a clock I can deal with all day, every day. And if it becomes a problem, I'll probably draw into Planar Cleansing before it becomes a relevant threat. I like that draw, honestly, because I think this guy runs plenty of counter magic. And I'm not going to give him a chance to um, counter a Tolerant Sky Summoner. I'm going to say he runs every single removal possible. So, and Anger of the Gods, which, fuck. But, I mean, at least... He, I said fuck because of Planar Cleansing, but at least he's filling up my yard. I can go get it now. That's another resource with this deck. Absolutely. Um, that's another good thing about playing against this deck. First of all, it's not very good. This mill deck is just, just because it says mill. I mean, no offense to you mill players. 
it just can't really happen efficiently. And that's kind of rude for me to say because I haven't tried to build it yet. And I was deep in the paint in 2014 thinking Demir was horrible, and it turned out to be really fun and uh, a really good deck, too. So we're going to draw out the counter. If he counters this, great. I can resolve. But even if I do resolve a tall run, he didn't even think about countering that. But I'm still saying he has it. We hit land drop seven, didn't we? Hopes and prayers. Do you um do the tall rend? We don't have eight mana. Tall rend. Hmm. I could run out of tall rend if he doesn't have it. I'll go ahead and Sphinx. Oh wow. Um with my hand, I think tall rend's a faster clock. And that's like that's like assuming I can do amazing math in my head just like real quick and assume multiple draws like in advance, which I can't do. Eight mana would be amazing because I would have Talrin plus uh, Inspiration. I think I'm going to run out the counter. This gets countered, but I think I'd rather have Talrin Sky Summoner, right? And it's okay if he counters this right now. I want to tank. I mean, it's legitimate. So if you're thinking about it, he's like, man, he, knew, he, he knows I have the counter and he wants me to counter this right now. Because that's pretty much what I'm saying there. Going in the tank with three mana open, two blue sources, that screams dissolve. So I'm saying I'm cool with you dissolving that. Now the question is, do you let it, uh, do you dissolve it? Fuck yes. <laughs> you dissolve um, a Sphinx Bone one every time. Now did I force him to play correctly? Sometimes you do that in Magic accidentally and poker. And that's something you absolutely want to uh, avoid. Possibly. Um, and <laughs> I'm telling you... <laughs> I don't know. Vincent, not horrible, dude. Um, Planar Cleanse is what I'm looking for. Oh, that's the other thing you might have to think about. He's keeping the gate open for Planar Cleansing. But I think this probably... This could be nullified, too. Yeah, I'm not... I mean, if it's if it's nullified, that's fine. That's okay. Um, you know, I mean, it's not great. But I do get to run out an Inspiration Nation right now, which I will do. Head case. And uh, we do have the Safe Passage again. Against the Vent Sentinel. Now that is horrible. I mean, we do we do have time. We got plenty of time, but we're not doing anything. We're not um, casting spells. Do you wait for him to tap out? He's not going to tap out. Like you, I think you go for everything I went for, right? Now maybe you do it in reverse order and try and resolve a Sphinx Bone Wand because they're a... no. I was about to say something horrifically stupid. I, I'm cool with that. I'm going to even say he has a negate in his hand right now, holding a negate. That's a card that does things. Now, it, it pay three, lose... Yeah, okay. Keeping up the counters is what I'm guessing. So, we have to draw out the counters. That's a decent draw. Now, all these safe passages look horrible, but... Ooh. I'll passage. No. I'm not going to pass it. I could pass it right now. I could pass it right now. Avoid... No, I, but it would be drawing out the counter. He doesn't have the counter, obviously. So, I think I... In step head case because I know he's not going to counter it so I could draw the win con those are the deadest draws those are the deadest draws ever safe not safe passage isn't safe passage will absolutely help me win this game because I'm going to safe passage with mana in tow so once he safe passages counters and if he's a smart player I guess he wouldn't right but I can run out a um another win con I'm thinking back on the turns. Do you do do you run out these? I think you fucking have to, but I think you have to maybe later. Maybe I should wait uh, later where I can cast like double tall rend. You know what I mean? Or run out the inspiration before uh, you run out tall rend in case he negates. And once again, <laughs> why? Why? I'll start doing calculus. You know what? I'm just fucking. I'll do it in in response. I'm driving shit over here while playing this game and talking. I don't know why I play this deck. There's so much so much thinking to do. And it is definitely on him. Vincent, go after it. After it. Now, what's interesting is he's not even going for the mill because he doesn't have to, right? Paying three, swing in. Do you play around burn? I don't have to. I'm at seven. He has negate. I can naturalize this. I'm going to run it out. Negate. Please, God bless America. This guy's good. He knows what he's doing because that's the smart. I, I that, That's the smart. That's smart, boy. Fog effect is horrible right now. I need 
draw spells, win cons. I should have ran out of inspiration. I'm immediately regretting it. Not immediately. I'm actually like four or five minutes down the road regretting it. But why don't you go for the mill, Blondie? Come on, man. Come on. Give me a fighting chance. Give me a fighting chance. That's all I need is a fighting chance because we're drawing into like inspir. Not really. We have one inspiration. His own inspiration. That's a dig at me. I'm gonna I'm gonna consider that a a, a personal dig at me right now. Um, but not really. Uh, I, I'd like think twice. Sphinx Bone Wand. He knows my win cons. I mean, these are literally my only two win cons. Thirty five cards remaining. Cloudfin Raptor. You keep surprising me with cards. And I still think it's a negate in your hand. I'm playing around negate. Now uh, it's... Oh, he can't attack. They all have Defender. Oh, uh, Fog Vec. Sure. I mean, eventually I might be able to... Uh, fog a lethal Cloudfin Raptor. If we have... Okay. I'm going to run out... Like I want him to tap out. So I need him to be right here. So the Vent Sentinel's for four... That's fine. I'll just uh, safe passage. If he has a counter, good. Then I top deck Sphinx Bone Wand. I lay it and win, right? Serendipity, baby. Serendipity. Uh, yeah, I have to do this because um, he kills me with this. So, I mean, that's not horrible for me. I mean, I don't lose to Vince Sentinel now. And we need top decked. Okay, I think that's really good, right? Because we don't need... We need actually Inspiration. If he wants to counter it, fine. I've got Sphinx Bone Wand in tow. We don't need these fogs. No more counters. Thank God it wasn't in a gate. Okay, Planar Cleansing. Shit! Count your mana. Is there any way I can count my... I can. I can go up here. Shit. Okay, that's three, four, five... I think I can Planar Cleanse. Confirm. I can afford it, right? Three, four, five, six, seven. Shit, this game went long. I'm going to vent sent, and I do still have the fog so I don't snap lose the vent sentinel. If you have negate, dude, you're brilliant. Okay, that makes sense. I don't lose. Uh, I am in burn range. Everything went away. I have fog in case he... Anything? Hello. I'm on caps lock over here instead of tab. Holy shit. Okay, we have Stabilize. He's drawing live to... Uh, I don't think... He, dude, there's no way he runs Shock, man. There's no way you run Burn. There's another Vent Scent, but I got Safe Passage. So I can hang out for a bit. Yeah, I can hang out for a bit. He can activate it once, right? So I go land, that's fine. Okay, we need Draw Spells exactly. Do you do... Do you do... Um, do you do Chica, a little Indiana Jones, to get back inspiration to draw into your other... Fine. To draw into your other, um... Inspiration to... I mean, yeah, you get inspiration to draw into your other Wink on. I don't know, maybe. I don't know why I did that then. There's a Think twice, so that's decent. Uh, I guess we could do this now, just in just in case he does something. I don't know. Uh, we're, we're missing a land drop right here, technically, and I don't really want to, so... I think we're actually going to flash it back, too. Let's get all our info right now because I think, let's see, three, four, five, six, seven. No, even if we drew um, a wing con, we would have to save passage anyway. So here we go. That was a very good card to draw, but I didn't draw anything from it. So we have to draw more Fuego. I'm at 29 cards. If he eventually mills me, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to laugh. So we save passage and save our ass. If he decides to counter, I've got another one in tow. But we're on a very significant clock. It's doing one damage and we have one life. Um, inspiration. Tall rend off the top. Cloud shift is part of it's part of the win that we need, right? Cool deck. I mean, the thing is, this deck plays fun against other combo decks because, like, he he's fine. Like, he's cool with it. He's like, I can just hang out. He's not countering my stuff because I don't run counters. The only the only thing I can do is um, try to win before he does, right? I can planar cleanse. So, I mean, that's some form of board man manipulation and countering your plans. Give me. Fuego. We're on a clock. All right. Do we need... The only thing that we need... Oh, wow. The thing is, though, dude, I guess I need another Planar Cleanse. And what What are the cards in his hand? I guess he thinks I'm, I'm countering things. I don't really know. He would have ran it out, though. No, I, I, I don't know what he's, what's in his hand, unless he's drawing just straight lands. 
But I think we've ran out of time, actually, because we would have to draw, like, Solrend, and we still lose. <laughs> oh, my God. This resolves. I'm walking away. What? Oh, let's do, oh he's, at least he's having a good time. I thought he was making fun of me because he had the counter, but he did that before I even cast it. Is that an... Voyage is in his own, bro. Okay, that gives me some time. I should just walk. I should walk to the other side of this room right now and just cool off because we're top decking some fuego right now. I mean, we did go a little bit dry on um for a little bit. Okay, so Voyage is in. Has he cast one of those? Did he show one of those? Because that's one. Is, that's one is in his hand. I'm gonna say it's just straight fucking Voyage's end. So Vince sent, and we're gonna need. Uh, we're gonna need uh, something right here. We lose. Uh, that's game. TG. Uh, yeah, I mean that was really good. Maybe. Oh fuck. That was good though. Uh, well played by him. GG. I mean, I don't want to say that because what if he gets cute and doesn't tap it out? But I, don't, I mean, he he knows what he's doing. He's been going for it every chance that he could. Uh, this is prevent all combat damage. This is not combat damage. That's just damage. So how's well played. I mean, that's exactly what he wants to see. It's unfortunate. Oh, man, that loss is unfortunate. We were close, kind of. And I really hate that inspiration. I think that's what did it. I think it was our detriment. Oh, well.